Oh my gosh, these are hilarious. I have got to create one of these for my clients. In this video, I'm gonna show you exactly how to create the Spirit Halloween uh, meme, and you'll sh I'll show you exactly how to do it in both your phone and on desktop. So go ahead and stay tuned if you wanna create this look, and it'll provide you with the template as well, so you don't have to go scouring the internet trying to figure this out. All right, let's get into the video, here we go. All right, so here we are inside my computer now, and I'm gonna show you how to actually edit the Spirit Halloween meme on Canva. So what you're gonna do is just use any old uh, Instagram square and you're gonna go ahead and grab that download. You should already have the download. You can just get it in the description down below. And we're gonna go ahead and put that here. Just pull it out a bit. And here we go. Now you can take this color in the background because as you can see, it doesn't fit quite nicely here, but you can take this background color and you can change this to black. Um, so that way it just kind of looks like it's on a black background. I like that look a little bit better. I mean, you can pull it out, but it'll mess up the, as you can see, it'll cut out some of it. So we're just gonna leave it right here in the middle. Now what we wanna do is find an image that we wanna use here on the side. I'm doing a whole thing around pretty woman. So that's why this picture is in here, why you shouldn't wear the boots. I call them the pretty woman boots. Anyway. That's another session for another time um, for a training that I'm doing around media. So anyway, that's why that picture is there. I just wanted to give an explanation. Um, so we're, we are going to find an image. Let me go ahead and upload an image that I want to use. All right, so I have an uh, image I'm going to use. So I'm going to click on that image. And as you can see, I'm a little like I'm off to the side. So I'm going to go ahead and crop this a bit. We're going to click on crop. I'm going to just take this and just pull it in to just capture only that photo and there we go all right now i'm going to remove the background we're going to click on edit image background remover and we're going to remove the background it's better to have a full length uh image but we're just going to use what i have for right now just for the purposes of this video you all know that usually um to have all right you all know that usually camera was going crazy here. Uh, you should have some type of like fool, but if you don't, if you just want to roll with what you got, then you can totally do that as well. So I have it here. I'm going to just position this. I actually don't like the way this is positioned, but for the purposes of this video, we're going to use it. So that part is done. Now what I'm going to do is go ahead and grab some text. So here's some text and you'll have to just play around with different text fonts. I'm gonna go with the basic text font for right now. I'm gonna change that color to white. There we are. I'm gonna go ahead and type in. Now that's all done. We're, our, our meme is pretty much finished at this point. We're just gonna go ahead and I will just resize this a little bit to bring that in. And then we're gonna go ahead and click on the share button, go to download. I always like to download these as PNGs, but you can download as a JPEG, whatever you feel like you wanna do on that. And that's it, voila, we are done. And that's it, our meme is done. It's ready to be posted on social media. So go ahead and let me know down in the comment section what your Spirit Halloween costume meme is going to say. I hope this video was helpful and useful to you. Please go ahead and make sure you subscribe to the channel. It just helps me out oh, and like, and make sure you leave a comment down below. It just helps me with the algorithm so that I can create more videos and tutorials like this. So if you are a social media manager, if you're a content creator, this is the channel for you to learn everything there is to know around content monetization. But also I throw in a couple of tutorials that I feel like you all may need that are time sensitive, especially in this time where the meme is going crazy. So go ahead and create one meme for your client or for yourself. And I can't wait to see your meme. Make sure you tag me on social media at Jaws Speaks Digital so that I can see your meme. Would love to see what you created. I'll see you all in the next video. Peace.